everyone so come travel with me from calabar to lagos using flights so i'm going to tell you guys my traveling experience entering there we paid a fee of 300 naira i don't really know what it is for sha guys do you know that this is like the first time in my life entering plane <laughs> Anyway, I'm so happy and I'm so excited. So these are some of the activities that are happening in the uh, airport. I stood in a very long line until it reached my turn. And I noticed that the woman that is giving the ticket knew me. <laughs> Guys, on my way to the uh, waiting center, I saw a uh, CY.com family guy. So here they had to tell me to drop all my stuff, even my glasses, my wristwatch. So I'm going to pass the stuff that they said there. I don't even know what they call this shah. So I dressed back and then I'm heading back to the waiting center. There I met a CY.com again and I asked him where is he going to. And he told me he's going to uh, MC Mbakara's child dedication. And I was like, okay. And he said, uh, we are going to go together to MC Mbakara's child dedication. See, I will keep on saying that in life, anything you are doing, just tell yourself or tell God, please let my leg lead me to my destiny, help out, just anything. I don't even know what you just just say. But at this point, I'm so happy and I'm so excited. Like my first time entering plane. Wow! But anyway, I'm going to tell you guys my experience as we head forward. So I entered the plane and thank God for uh, CY.com. He was there to do some videos and I did videos also because he's also a content creator and I'm also a content creator. So you guys should do well to go and follow his page. So I entered the plane and my seat number was 5C. Like I was so I'm feeling so bad. I thought that I'm going to stay by the window side. So I'm going to be capturing a lot of moments, but I didn't. Huh? And I was not happy. So they told us to fasten our seat belt and also the air hostess we are giving some directions and also the pilot was also uh giving some talks <laughs> so you guys should hear his sexy voice i just want to capture this moment if not for anybody for my own self so i'm going to remember my first experience guys as they carry out the safety demonstration on board this Boeing 737 300 series Ladies and gentlemen, please fasten your seatbelt this way. So I'm just your seatbelt, simply pull on the strap. To unfasten it, raise the latch ball and help. Always observe the no smoking and the fasten seatbelt sign whenever you need it. On the passenger service, you can involve your head, you have your engine carriage in light. Adjustable air vent and you can call it. So she was giving directions on how to wear the uh, max, like in case if we fall inside uh, water, God forbid, I beg, and many, and many other things she taught, uh, many other things, places to touch, we had to take our stuff down. She, they taught a lot of things and I was enjoying the experience. Guys, our plane took off and I'm so, like, the speed that the plane using, taking off, guys, like my heart just skipped. And I noticed a very sharp light, like, out of the uh, window, yeah. And also, guys, like, I was seeing the blue sky, like, the blue sky. <laughs> So they gave us snacks, so and me, I was munching my snacks every 10, 10 minutes. I was just munch one every 10. But guys, tell me why Francisca is eating bread and water. And I noticed that <laughs> I noticed that one man in my bag was looking at me. He would be like, where did this village girl come from? And suddenly I started having uh, goosebumps on my body. Anyway, I don't really know. I would say number one is the cold. I'm not used to that too many. Like, the cold was too much. And also, like, I think I was a little nervous. Sha. Guys, I just enjoy. I would, like, all through the flight, I would not like to. I was looking out of my window. And then, we are already in Lagos. I had to apply my lipstick. And 
so we are good to go guys and i noticed that the people that this man is giving their bags to are the people in the first class and we we are in the uh domestic or second class right i don't really know so we're already in the airport so see this this is how uh everywhere looks it's so so beautiful guys i have not entered inside a, an airport like this <laughs> why am i sounding so native <laughs> Well, anyway, the experience was wow, wow, woo, like I enjoyed it and I was with uh, CY.com this time. I didn't carry any luggage, but he carried uh, his bag, his traveling bag, and he said he wants to go and get it from there, which I followed him and I waited for him. So my, like staying there, I didn't really capture the moment. I met a fan. <laughs> She's also uh, Igbo. Her name is Oye. We greeted, we shouted, and it was all uh, to God's grace. So we are outside. Bye.